I just wanted to make a little video and kind of um, say what's what's happened, what's going on, what's an update, everything like that. Um, just to, I guess, update you guys with what's going on. So I haven't really made any progress on on the LS swap. That's anything major. Um, hopefully soon, maybe in the next two weeks, I'll maybe get the the actual engine in the car, uh, make some engine mounts and stuff like that. But. It, um, I have like two midterms and two projects and actually I'll show you guys one of the projects I made um, so nothing's really been crazy except I did I did get kind of all the stuff from Holly so nothing's really I mean I, like you can see I don't have all the fasteners on nothing I just mocked all the stuff up Chappie's been been working on this stuff for me um, but I got the the turbo manifolds and the intake manifold from Holly. I also have the uh, the ECU for the the Dominator ECU. I don't have any of the accessories for it though, um, so it's still a work in progress. But this is a little crossover pipe for TH400, and um, yeah, this is this thing looks so cool. Um, but it's coming along. I mean, it, it's just really slow when, when you don't really have that much money because you're not working. And then also you're completely busy. But I also got a roll cage or a roll bar to put in the Mustang. Now, this is actually just a four point, but I can add and weld in like two more to make it a six point cage. Um, you can see it's, it's kind of all, all around here. But yeah. Um, there's not much else up update. There's not much else to update on that. I've been doing some welding because um, all I I'm gonna make the rest of the hot side just the manifolds or what came in the kit, and then I'm gonna make all the cold side. But I did some welding. I made a little V band with a T4 flange. Um, but my welds are a work in progress. I'm pretty sure this will work though. <laughs> so this is my this is one of my projects for. I'm in sandals. So excuse me. This is one of my dynamics projects. Um, this is kind of cool. I've been working on this all day yesterday, but this is actually old V6 parts. This is an old V6 cam. The lifter isn't from a V6, it's from a big block Chevy. And then the valve's from a, a 4.8. But um, basically I just need to get a spring to bring this cam back, I mean, to bring the valve back down and then an electric motor. And then I, I have to simulate this and then do the math behind it as well. Um, for relating the uh, cam lobes to the valve as far as like acceleration velocity and all that so it's kind of cool um, nothing really that crazy or difficult to do um, my welds are really not that good you can see it's a, I'm learning how to weld so um, other than that I guess I've shown you all the turbo before um, let me zoom out a little more um, yeah, I, I guess there's nothing else that's new. I guess I lost my, my monetization, which I guess it really wasn't that much. However, I think it was maybe like over the past year, I made like around 300 bucks off YouTube, which isn't really that bad and it sucks to lose it, but it looks like I'll probably get it back within a month or two months based on how many subscribers I keep getting. Cause once I hit a thousand, I get the monetization back, but, um, that'll be kind of cool to get back. <laughs> Other than that, um, if you guys have any questions with the update on the swap, um, feel free to ask. I also did get, I don't know if I shared this, I did get a set of LSA rods and a crank. Um, so if I build a 6.0 in the future, um, that'll pro it'll probably be like a cheap build like that. The uh, That's a 5.3 right there, and that's actually going to be what I use for the very beginning of the swap. Um, and then once the car's tuned and all, all together, then I will, then I'll do a 6.0 build and try to make a thousand wheel. So that's about it. The shop's kind of empty. My roommate's car's not here. And I moved the lightning because I just don't have time for it this semester. But yeah, that's it. The car looks good. I really miss driving it. This weekend was TX2K, but I just didn't go to anything because kind of what's the point when you don't have anything to, to drive around with. Anyways, 
if you guys have any questions, just let me know. I appreciate you guys watching and this is a small little update video to let y'all know what's going on. Um, I'll make a video if I get the engine in the car within the next two weeks or whatever and, and make a video of making the motor mounts and everything. So, all right. Y'all have a good one. I'm out. Thank you.